Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Logan. If you're new, welcome. And today I'm going to share with you, as you can tell, the Kylie Cosmetics mini Valentine's Day kit. I haven't opened it. I just got it in the mail. I haven't opened it yet. I just wanted to do a little unboxing and do some swatches for you guys. Um, this is going to be for caramel kind of skin tones so you have an idea of what my skin tone is I'm just gonna let you know some foundations that I use and the color so in the Smashbox Studio Skin I wear a 3.35 in the Milani 2 in 1 foundation and concealer I wear the color Amber number 11 and in the Estee Lauder double wear foundation I wear the rich caramel 5w2 so that is my skin tone if you wear any of those foundations in any of the three shades that I mentioned then this would definitely be more accurate for you but if you don't still you can kind of get an idea of what it might look like so now i'm going to open the box it came in the regular black kylie cosmetics box and not the regular normal box i actually thought that it was going to come in a special valentine's day box but it didn't i do own a few kylie lip kits and this is one of them that I'm wearing right now, and this is Vixen from her holiday collection. I actually got it when she had it on promo, and I got it for free. So, that was a plus. I was really excited to purchase this specific mini kit just because it had two colors that I really wanted to try. Let me stop talking and let's just get into it. Okay comes in standard regular Kylie box has the card this one doesn't have a Valentine's Day card I thought it might have a specific Valentine's Day card but it didn't so this is the box This is the first time I got her mini collections, any of the, her mini collections, so I'm not really sure what to expect as far as size, but I wasn't too worried about the size just because, let's be honest, how many of us have actually finished an entire liquid lipstick? Show of hands? Okay. <laughs> um, some people have, some people haven't. I personally have not that I remember so this is really good you get a variety of shades and they're smaller so maybe you will be able to finish them so these are really tiny like they're super tiny they are really mini so this is what they look like And the shades that are in here are Apricot, Malibu, High Maintenance, Posy K, Head Over Heels, and Mary Jo K. Um, I wanted Posy K and Mary Jo K, so we'll see how it looks on me. And yeah, I'm gonna compare one of them to the actual regular full size just so you can get kind of an idea of the size difference so right here I have Vixen from her holiday collection and this is apricot from her Valentine's Day collection so these are the size differences pretty pretty big size difference um, I actually thought it might be like as wide as these are just shorter but they're skinnier and shorter so it's a pretty significant size difference 
So now we're going to get into the swatches. I'm going to try to go from light to dark. In the packet it is from light to dark. So I'm going to start with apricot, especially since I have it out now. And we're just going to go from right to left. Now that I took my other one off, I'm going to start with apricot. It already, it looks like it might be a little too light for me. I did put a little foundation over my lips just so that they would not be dark underneath. So, yeah, we'll see. Whoa, it's super light like I thought. This would actually look good with a liner or if I was doing an ombre lip. Um, but just by itself, it's a little too light for my skin tone, but maybe on a lighter skin tone, it will probably look better. It has a very nice peachy pinky tone to it, and it's the perfect nude for someone who is lighter skinned. But that is the apricot. Alright, the next shade that we have is, let's see, the next shade that we have is Malibu. This looks like another nude color, um, I'm not sure if it's going to be too light for me. It looks like I would have to line this one as well, but we'll see. So I actually, I actually really like love this color I didn't think that I would but this is like the perfect nude matte lip for me I would definitely line it with the true brown liner and that would give me a nice nude lip so maybe if I run out of this one I might have to buy the full size this is a color that she does have in the full sizes I'm pretty sure she does have all of them in full sizes but this one is not part of the Valentine's Day collection, so you can get it any time. So this is Malibu. The next color that I have to try is... High Maintenance. I think this is a strictly Valentine's Day shade. So, yeah, we'll see. This is a new shade, and then there's another one in there that's a new shade. So, we'll see how this looks. Um, This is like a pale pink color. It might be too light for me. <laughs> a lot, all of these colors are really light pinky, kind of nude kind of colors. And in the tube, it kind of looks light. When you put them on, they look different than they do in the tube. So, we'll see how this one looks. At first glance this definitely looks way too light for me it is a very pretty pink but for my skin tone it's a little too light we'll mix this with another color or line it with a dark liner and kind of create like an ombre look but I would definitely not wear this by itself it is way too The next color that we have is Posey K. I'm really excited to try this one because I wanted it since last year, since I purchased my first lip kit and it sold out, so I wasn't able to get it. So I'm excited that I'm able to try it now. This is what Posey looks like dry. I am happy with this color. I'm actually happy that I didn't get the full size because I do have similar colors to it. And I can mix those colors to create this exact shade. So I'm happy that I didn't buy the full size, but I really do like this color and I'll definitely be using it with a liner, a darker liner and creating a cute pink ombre lip. So I think that'll be really nice. If you do like this color and are interested in purchasing it, she does have it on her website. This is not one of the Valentine's Day shades, so you can pick it up at any time. She does have it in singles as well as gloss, 
and in a kit so you have options to choose from so this is cozy the next shade that I'm going to try is head over heels this is one of the Valentine's Day shades so after this collection I don't think that she'll be bringing it back it looks darker than posy so I'm most likely gonna like it but we'll see I love this one actually so this is a very nice pinky berry kind of tone it actually surprisingly is one of my favorites now <laughs> if you are someone who wants to ease into you know bold colors this is a really nice shade for you it's not too light it's not too bright and in your face it's a really nice pinky berry color and i really like it so this is head over heels So last but not least we have Mary Jo K. I have been wanting to try this shade because I've been looking for the perfect blue tone red. So we'll see if it's a true blue red liquid lip. Yes! Come through Mary Jo! This is the best red that I have tried in a while besides my MAC Ruby Woo but that one is a little dry um I do like these liquid lipsticks better well I do prefer liquid lipsticks over a regular lipstick um just because they're easy to apply and lately I have been using liquid lipsticks that are very comfortable on my lips this is very comfortable and it's the perfect red especially the perfect red that i've been looking for so i might have to uh buy full size once i finish this but um yeah this red is really really pretty and perfect for every skin tone you can't really go wrong with a red for most people it's just trying the different shades there's so many shades of red but once you find your perfect red it's like oh yes so happy so this is definitely a perfect red for me i love it and this is mary jo i don't really do makeup related videos on my channel but i did get this kit and i wanted to share it with you all Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let me know if you use any of these shades and what you think about them. And have a happy Valentine's Day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!